uh, welcome from the stop to be partnership um, we are today in uh, july 2019 the world has only 138 months for uh, the sdg target of ending tb as a epidemic uh, we have just 41 months from now till 2022 end when the un hlm targets and commitments have to be achieved in addition we have countries like india which has a higher ambition level where pm modi has committed to end tb by 2025 and there we have 78 months to do the job so urgency is very important in the response uh, in the tb response so far what we had seen was uh, progress is there but is going slow and uh, we consider the un hlm that happened last year in 2018 as a turning point a turning point where things could change this directional change is perhaps starting to happen now the unhlm political declaration has some bold quantitative and qualitative targets and commitments they have to be achieved by the end of 2022 we also have to move fast towards ending tb as an epidemic we are very pleased to see that the commitment which was there in countries at the level of national tb programs now have gone to a much higher level we now see ministers of health but even beyond prime ministers and presidents talk about tb this is great to have and this is a big directional shift that has happened today along with the commitment we need to have a few other things and three things i consider are important number 1 is resources it's not just enough to say that we commit to do something we need the resources to do it we are very pleased to see how in india with the prime minister's commitment came a increase in the domestic budget for tb in the country which has gone a few times higher than what it used to be that sort of commitment we are slowly expecting in many other high tb burden countries number 2 is action and we must do actions in a way that we will find the people with tb that we have missed in the past this means business unusual not usual we must also do new things like preventive therapy for people who have not yet developed active tb disease but uh, but are at risk of developing them we also need to do many more things for leaving no one behind in the tb response so these actions need to be happening at the country level at the sub national level and at the level at the level where uh, people seek care number 3 very important what we need is accountability what get measured and what comes to the table of high level decision makers will be done if it is not measured if it is not known to high level decision makers things will not be done so this is very important that we engage our leaders politicians heads of states provincial governors or whatever systems countries have to make leaders accountable for the tb response in their area we from stop tb partnership have disaggregated the unhlm global targets into country level targets these are available on the website of stop tb these are indicative targets for countries when we encourage countries to be even bold and exceed in their planning these targets these targets we are very encouraged that some of the high burden countries which are big they have taken these targets and also broken down by their states 
provinces and districts. This is how accountability can be fixed at different levels. We are also trying to find ways, opportunities of using global regional forum where heads of governments assemble to make it possible for them to look at their performance, looking at some key indicators, targets and commitments. This is how I think things can change and we can move fast towards the targets and commitments we have made. Urgency is very important. Thank you.